You might like the movie Spawn, but here's a bunch of people who hated it. I fell asleep trying to watch this movie for the first time during the second time I wished I was asleep. You know, commas would help not make that confusing. <laughs> well, at least you watched the movie the second time, so you now know that you hate it. It's not funny, it's just poignant. Enough spawning, time for some neutering. Are we making it so that Spawn can't have a sequel? Or are we making it so that Spawn can't have a child? Like a little demon child? Which is all children? I can't even watch the full thing. What the f seriously now? Man, you're just giving me the worst punctuation possible, aren't you? <laughs> I mean, obviously there's the obligatory you didn't watch the movie. Other than that, and you're seriously upset for a movie. You also made me read your entire thought and you didn't even watch the entire movie, so f you too. Are they allowed to say whacked in this synopsis? <laughs> I feel like superheroes shouldn't be whacked, especially when they get whacked to become superheroes. It's just not right. <laughs> Your problem with the movie is how they said he got killed? Like if they said killed, five stars. But because they said whacked, suck a dick. <laughs> Stupid synonyms. I don't mind this being a movie about a guy who gets sent to hell after he dies and gains superpowers even though I am Christian. The major problem I have with this movie is the cheap special effects, rush storyline, and terrible acting. I'm glad your religion didn't get, you, get in the way of you hating a movie. Because it's very Christian of you. I'm almost embarrassed that I watched this. Thank God I was just eight. Yeah, you were embarrassed enough to write it down for the whole internet to see. It's like having a small dick and constantly sending dick pics. Actually, that probably happens. Next time, Gadget. Next time! <laughs> I know you hate it, but I love this comment. <laughs> Can someone make a cut with that as the end when he defeats the guy? I would pay way more money than I should for that. John Leguizamo, good. Movie, bad. Thanks, Frankenstein. Someone just needs to kill that motherfucking clown. Yeah. He did. You're welcome. I feel like you watched a documentary on John Wayne Gacy. When John Leguizamo is not the worst thing in the movie, you know you're watching something particularly terrible. Euthanize this one. That is so mean to John Leguizamo. He ruins every movie. I feel like... He's not the reason Super Mario Brothers was shit. One of the better comic book adaptations before X-Men came out. Oh wait, there were no good comic book adaptations before X-Men. Uh, Batman? Superman? There's two superheroes with movies that were before that, you know, that were good. This is the Todd McFarlane of movies. He, he created Spawn, and it's a movie about Spawn. That is all. Proof that movies based on comic books not only can suck, but can blow chunks too. Who's chunks? <laughs> it's the obligatory joke. Although there are some great special effects, that's all this film has going for it. You like the special effects? I am confused by your standards. <laughs> it's about just as confusing as you saying there's a difference between sucking and blowing chunks, other than One's a physically inward movement, and the other one's the repercussions of that. But they're still connected. It's less confusing. I'm gonna stop now. Gaze ye too long into superhero Drek, and Todd McFarlane gazes also into thee. That is f***ing terrifying. <laughs> it really is the Todd McFarlane of movies. Because it sees inside my soul, and what I truly want. You won't believe how bad this is. Well, not based off of any information you provided me. Number seven will blow your mind. <laughs> Thanks, Buzzfeed. Would rather peel my foreskin back with a grapefruit knife than watch this shit again. What's a grapefruit knife? Isn't it weird that that's the thing I'm questioning? <laughs> this movie should stay in the 90s where it was great. And someone should invent time travel? I guess nostalgia is a bitch on occasion. It's like Fahrenheit 451, December 31st, 1999. 
every copy of Spawn is removed from anything. Stay where you belong, Spawn. In the 90s. Yuck, this movie made me want to throw up. Is it Marvel? Did it make you want to blow chunks? <laughs> I wonder why you're asking if it's Marvel. Well, I don't know. I don't know if you don't like Marvel, or if you like Marvel and you're wondering if they made this and it sucks. Either way, movies shouldn't have vomiting effects. So, you should see a doctor. A superhero movie from the 1990s. You should know better. About what? What am I not supposed to, what am I supposed to know better? Confusing review is confusing. <laughs> really bad Batman wannabe. John Leguizamo's over the top performance is the only redeeming factor. You mean the really bad Joker? Gotcha. Burn. K. Movie. Good effect. Better watch Black Dynamite. 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 Don't watch that comic book movie. Watch that black exploitation film. Don't eat that popsicle. Ride bikes. I couldn't recognize John Leguizamo in this movie. Good. That was what they were going for with the whole f***ed up makeup thing. And if you did recognize him, he is diseased. <laughs> Spawn. Spawn? Duke of Deep Fried. This movie was terrible. What? What? You write with the lisp? <laughs> How is that possible? I just, I just always done it. <laughs> It'd be funny if you wrote with the lisp, to, but talked without a lisp. Or wrote with the lisp, but stuttered. Or wrote with the lisp, didn't have a lisp when you talked, but stuttered when you did sign language. My brain hurts. <laughs> Terrible comic book adaptation of a shit comic book. You can't get much worse than this. Other than the placement of that comma. Oh, I can get worse. Much worse. I kinda wish your address was on here so I could send you Catwoman. Own it on Laserdisc. Looks like someone learned how to time travel. Watching this film is like stabbing out your own brain with a rusty spoon. Rusty spoon. Now I wanna go binge with salad fingers and creep myself out. <laughs> the Crow is a better spawn adaptation than spawn. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> and yet Spawn is a better adaptation of Constantine. No? Well, f*** you. After viewing this, I wanted to shove poorly CGI'd fireballs down the director's throat. Well, you could with a little practice and a computer. And then the world is yours for 50 bucks a month. <laughs> it's an Adobe joke that two people will get. They should all commit suicide for this. For it? Like in honor of it? <laughs> Spawn, I'm doing this for you. Hey. <laughs> if it's your first time here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell right next to it. Also, if you want to see another video from us, hit one of the ones on the screen. And until we see you next time, geek out and game on.